Investment in securities market is subject to market risks. Read all the related documents carefully before investing. We know that long term equity returns in India are in the vicinity of anywhere between 13 to 15%, right? If we take the last 30, 40 years. Right, over this 23 year period was roughly around 57%. Achha. So if I take a random month over the last 30 years, I will invest in 57%. 57% probability ki mera paisa banega. Banega. Right? And we are talking about again this 284 months, Achha. right? And you take any 10 year within these any 120 months, any, any 120 months, months uh, right? Okay. Then your odds of losing money is zero. Hi there, my name is Saurabh Mukherjee and it's my pleasure to welcome you to the third episode of Guru Mantra with Saurabh. I work for Marcellus Investment Managers and I'm joined on this podcast by my colleague Krishnan. Krishnan heads our Investment Advisory Vertical. So in the first episode of, uh, of Guru Mantra with Saurabh, we, we discussed the importance of allocating a chunky amount of your portfolio, a significant amount of your portfolio to, to equities. In the second episode, we discussed the importance of long-term compounding. In this episode, the third episode, we will discuss the importance of disciplined investing. Right? Anushasan ka jo, ka jo central role hai investment success mein, us pe hum focus karenge in the third podcast. Now, Krishnan, this is the age of T20. This is the age of social media. Attention spans are short. Uh, people's time horizons are short. So, how does a how does an investor build discipline and patience? Can you help the the viewers understand the importance of disciplined, patient, long term investing? Sure. So, uh, look, I mean, uh, like we discussed, equities are the higher risk asset class uh, and uh, it's, uh, you know, periods of volatility can be unnerving for most investors, right? And uh, it can even tempt us to get out of markets altogether. Um, equities, uh, like I said, are riskier than debt instruments like, uh, uh, you know, fixed deposits uh, and uh, maybe even gold, right? This means uh, returns are lumpy and can fluctuate year on year. Now, if you take an example, right, uh, and just look at the, the Nifty 50 index mm -hmm. from January uh, 2000 to September 2023, right? Uh, so we are almost talking about a 23 year period. Um, there, there has been, uh, you know, so Nifty 50 has seen a drawdown of more than 20%. It's over in 58 out of the 284 months, mm -hmm. right? So there are 284 months over this 23 year period. Yeah. And Nifty has seen more than 20% drawdown in 58. So more than 20% drawdown is, is pretty severe, right? Right. For any in investor. 58 out of the 220, 284 months. 284 months. Nifty has seen a more than 20%. More than 20% drawdown, wow. right? So this sounds quite, uh, very scary, uh, but during this very same period over this 23 years, uh, let's not forget that Nifty 50 uh, again has compounded investors wealth by, uh, by roughly around 11.3% per year or roughly 12.4 times. So someone who had invested one lakh in January 20, uh, January 2000, uh, would have compounded their invested wealth to almost 12.4 lakhs over the 20 over years. Over the 23. In years. spite of these scary months. Exactly. In spite of the scary months, जो लंबा खेला है, लंबा खेला है उसका एक लाख, बारह लाख हुआ है. Yes. Very interesting. So, so you know, uh, one of the things I, I I have noticed. I'm a bit of a cricket lover, and I, I used to be a very big Virender Sehwag fan, right? And Virender Sehwag, as you know, is known for dhuwadhar batting, right? Hard hitting batting. Now, it used to fascinate me that Virender Sehwag's uh, 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 T20 average was around 21 or 22. His uh, one day average was around 35, 37, and his Test average was nearly 50. So, the longer the format of the game. Even though Virender Sehwag is known as an explosive batsman, the longer the format of the game, the higher Virender Sehwag's batting average, right? Does that also apply to high quality stocks that the longer the time horizon, the better the return from high quality stocks? Yes, it does. Right. Very it interesting. Does. So, uh, so if, if you think about, you know, again, uh, you know, as you hold high quality stocks, you know, it's, it's simply that again, uh, you know, th these are stocks, you know, again, which uh, consistently deliver profits. Right, and they keep on compounding their, uh, you know, their, their profits, their revenues, you know, the fundamentals keep on compounding. So, you know, if you are investing in, for example, a company, right, which is compounding its, uh, you know, profits or its, uh, you know, its cash flows hmm. uh, by say 20% or north of say even 15% every year, over a long period of time, you should expect the the returns to be around the same ballpark. 
and we have all when we discussed in the previous podcast right if your uh, returns are compounding by 18% or even more than 15% so we discussed 15% number but if it's compounding at 18% you can imagine over a 10 year or even a 20 year period what the outcome would be right so let's put some precise numbers around it we know that long term equity returns in india are in the vicinity of any between 13 to 15% right if we take the last 30 40 years and uh, basis the the number crunching you and your colleagues have done we also know that the standard deviation standard deviation folks is a measure of volatility kitni uchhal hai equities mein up and down kitni hoti hai standard deviation indian equities ki 1990 se leke 2023 3 tak standard deviation was around 26% now can you help us understand what that what does that mean if i if i am invested in stocks for a month what does that mean if i am invested in stocks for a year what does that mean 10 years yeah so what our analysis shows is the odds Haan, right or the probability uh, the probability Haan, Uh, of earning a positive return right uh, in any one month right over this 23 year period was roughly around 57% acha so if i take a random month over the last 30 years ek mahina main invest karke rahu 57% probability ki mera paisa banega banega theek hai right and if you now take this to a one year period yeah. right one year holding period this probability or this odds rises to 75% acha ठीक है थ्री एंड एंड नाउ इफ यू एक्सटेंड योर इन्वेस्टमेंट होराइजन टू टेन इयर्स राइट राइट एंड इफ यू टेक एनी टेन इयर्स एंड वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट अगेन दिस टू एटी फोर मंथ्स राइट एंड यू टेक एनी टेन इयर विद इन दिस एनी वन ट्वेंटी मंथ्स एनी वन ट्वेंटी मंथ्स राइट then your odds of losing money is zero right matlab 100% 100% 10 saal ka holding period hoga to 100% hai ki paisa bane banega right uh, uh, even the great say virat kohli can assure us of a century every time he plays but the indian stock market assures you a return provided you stay invested for at least 10 years right this is important provided you stay invested for at least 10 years if you try to enter the market and fatafat dana dana earn some money i'm afraid neither krishna nor i nor anybody else has any ready recipe for you but provided you are willing to give it 10 years the indian stock market's data suggests ki aapka paisa nischit tarike se kaip se banega right now let's let's go about let's go into you know uh, 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 more cricketing analogies here more cricket analogies we, we in marcelus are cricket crazy people uh, other than stock market cricket is a easy uh, source of entertainment for quantitative uh, quantitative people can you give us other cricketing analogies of the virtue of patience right why yeah. is it important to be patient kuch aur examples cricket se aap agar de to maza aa jaye sure so uh, you know equity investing is actually you know very close to test cricket in fact right um, because uh, like we said investing uh, in stocks requires patience and you know again you need to stay invested right and need to be able to you know put through volatility in the markets um, if you think about test cricket uh, it requires a similar approach right uh you know because uh, you know test matches if you think about it you know it's less bound by any time constraint hmm. right and because time is on their side uh, of players what you see generally see is very good batsmen right the one clear strategy they employ while they're playing test matches is they will play defensively right with uh, you know when there's a good bowler on the other side huh. or when there's a new ball right right very interesting uh, and so so uh, what's the you know take away right uh, essentially they are trying to ride out the difficult phase right because right. you know you're not bound by you know a 50 over or a 20 over uh, you know constraint so you can essentially pace your innings properly right. by riding out again or you know again playing defensively against a good bowler or against very rough conditions and then taking your chances or playing more aggressive or risky uh, uh, shots when you get the chance so so in the most uh, 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 premium form of cricket which is test cricket unfortunately for t20 lovers t20 is not the premium form of the game in the most serious form of cricket test cricket the patient batsman the batsman who's able to bat out long periods of time is the champion who wins matches nobody better than the great rahul dravid uh, now the coach of the indian team who epitomizes this in contrast the english players are trying something called baseball mm-hmm. which is trying to hit every ball out of the park it's not working out for the english at many different levels you are not going to be following the baseball model i am sure you are focusing on the great rahul dravid show discipline show patience in equity investing give it at least 5 years ideally take a 10 year horizon the indian stock market will be kind to you the indian stock market will be generous to you that brings to an end the third episode of guru mantra with saurabh this was on discipline we look forward to to your joining us on the fourth episode to discuss why focusing on news and uh, and macro developments is not a good idea thank you so much